97.5 KMOD, the doctor, ladies and gentlemen, has flown in and has lit. It's time to, <laughs> it's time to go out on a limb with Dr. Gene Squat. Hello, friends. And welcome back once again into my karmic conestoga, where I invite you to join this little wagon train of truth. I call the Crystal Comic Book Cathedral. Of course, I'm your host and the man who just got flipped off by his inner child, Dr. Gene Squat. Yes, a man for all seasons with breath that is pleasing. Here for one reason, and that's to Dean at the doers of doom, brethren. Hey, Marilyn, to grab up the gas leak in Sue and neuter off the naughty parts. Oh, <laughs> For Inge Pombasa prepaid them. I brought twins home last night. I can't wait to inflate them. Oh, rookie, hookie, cookie, tookie, bookie, schnooky, wookie, nookie. Ladies and gentlemen, Bert Lancaster. All right, get on your horse and go back home to mama. <laughs> I may be your lover, but I ain't no dancer. Or indeed, friends, that we're battling here. Is that rotten, no good, low life? The magic is almost here, kind of evil. It's a kind that lets the guilty go free. The same stuff that forced you to get down on one knee. Oh, why do you think that after one sip of her Coke, she's got to go pee? What else can it be if it ain't evil? <laughs> Oh, is it food allergies? No, sir. Is it the proliferation of a right-wing media faction and its hidden homophobic agenda? Huh? Is it from seeing too many bear boobies before you was 12? Me and Macaulay Culkin say, hell no! For your simple friends, it was alien. And it don't matter who you are. From the most high and revered world leader down to the kind of dame that makes men sweat in places that only special kind of doctors ever have to look at. And you must guard against it, friends. I'm going to try that Burt Lancaster one more time. For like an unholy water to plot to see you, it will clog the lateral lines that run into the septic tanks of your salvation. And the only way to jar it loose, friends, is a big dose of refraino Drano. That's right. For I believe that by practicing restraint and moderation, it will lessen the temptations of evil. Of course, I also believe in discipline, self-denial, and the occasional force sniffing of a sweaty workout garment. But don't let that deter you from giving in to your generous urges and supporting this ministry. Supporting it in the form of cash, personal checks, or just a couple of coins I can put down in my pants pockets to give my hands something else to do. Please send it on to me, Doc Squad! And I'll see to it that these messages filled with inspiration, jubilation, and flagellation will continue. And if there's anything left over, I'd like to buy Richard Simmons a Librium and a long pair of pants. Trust me! Ah, I got a really good feeling about this one. Get on your horse and go back home to mama. <laughs> <laughs> I think you nailed it. Oh, man.